U.S. President Donald Trump welcomed today the arrival of three Americans who were released by North Korea a day ago. The release took place in yet another conciliatory gesture ahead of the upcoming summit between the two countries. Kim dong Tar, Tony Kim, and Kim ak Song are all Korean Americans who were detained on charges of espionage or the hostile acts against the communist regime. They were set free after the U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo met North Korean leader Kim Jong-un in Pyongyang. Trump and First Lady Melania Trump greeted them at the Joint Base Andrews in Maryland in a ceremony that apparently highlighted his administration's major diplomatic coup ahead of the November midterm elections. Calling them great, incredible people, Trump congratulated them on their release before his summit with Kim. I'm honored to have helped three folks, Trump said. But the true honor is going to be getting rid of nuclear weapons, he added, apparently underscoring his resolve to pressure the North to renounce its nuclear ambitions. The three Americans expressed their joy, making victory signs with their fingers as they walked down the stairs from the airplane. We are very, very happy, one of them told reporters. Kim dong Tae, a Christian missionary, was arrested on spying charges in the North's Special Economic Zone in Rasun in October 2015. Tony Kim, whose Korean name is Kim sang Dok, was arrested on charges of hostile acts at Pyongyang Sunan International Airport in April last year. He was about to leave the North after his stint as a visiting professor at the Pyongyang University of Science and Technology. Kim ak Song was detained for alleged hostile acts at Pyongyang Station in May last year when he was waiting to return home in Dandong, China. Before the arrest, he worked at Pyongyang University of Science and Technology sharing agricultural technologies. M. Ji Won Chung, Yanam News.